This tutorial covers the basic functions and features of the iPad Trader. The iPad Trader allows users to open demo accounts directly from the login screen. To open the demo account, simply select the registration icon found within the bottom right hand corner of the screen. Once you have completed the registration form, click the register button. Another feature of the iPad Trader is its ability to save account information for multiple accounts. The Save Account Details option allows you to choose which accounts you wish to save your password for and which accounts you wish to remain unsaved. Once you have logged into the account, this can be found within the Account Number field. By selecting the Edit option in the top right hand corner of the screen, you are able to remove unwanted accounts and also accounts that you no longer wish to save the details for. To save your account password within the iPad Trader, please ensure that the Remember Password option is switched on within the settings of your iPad. To save your account details without the password, simply switch off the Remember Password option. With its fully customizable interface, the iPad Trader allows you to rearrange, add, remove or adjust any of the windows to your liking. Windows can be added by selecting the Add icon in the top left hand corner of the screen. Once you've selected the type of window you wish to open, a navigation option will appear, allowing you to choose the position of this window. Windows can be dragged and dropped to form tabs and they may also be added to other windows. You are able to resize your windows by selecting the resize option from the top left corner of the platform. When resizing windows, these can be adjusted horizontally and vertically. The iPad Trader features four desktops within the one application, allowing you to easily customise and view a number of different layouts. The Favourites section allows you to group your favourite tradable symbols so that these may be easily accessed. The Favourites spot panes allow users to place trades directly from the Favourites window. These can be added or removed by selecting the Options icon within the corner of the window and selecting Edit. From here, your favourite tradable symbols may also be rearranged. Symbols may also be removed by selecting the close option within the corner of the spot pane itself. The lock icon along the top of the platform allows you to lock your spot panes ensuring that no accidental trades are placed. When the lock icon shows as locked, this locks all spot panes throughout the application. The rate section of the iPad Trader contains all available instruments, their bid and ask rates, the highs and lows for the current day and the times these were last updated. From within the rate section you have the ability to place instant or pending orders, show charts or add symbols to your favourites. The 
The position section shows the order details of your open positions and pending orders. As well as allowing you to close an open position or modify an order, it also indicates the balance with your current profit or loss, including swap and commission. Also shown is your used margin, free margin, equity, credit and your margin level. Your trade history gives you a comprehensive rundown of all your closed orders, removed pending orders, deposits, withdrawals and credits. By clicking on the options icon within the left hand corner of the window you are able to request a specific period of history. Simply select the start date and the end date. The news section provides news feeds from the broker's server. To open the article, simply tap to download the text. At the bottom of the window, you will find a delete option. The mail section provides MT4 internal mail. To open the mail, again click on the mail to view. Once again you are able to delete open mail by selecting the delete option at the bottom of the window. The economic calendar shows all upcoming events with actual and previous figures. Also provided within the iPad Trader is a contacts page which contains the broker's contact details.